Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, yesterday on the 26th of August, Microsoft rolled out the latest beta channel Insider Preview Build for the Windows 11 Insiders, Build 22635.4082, and that was made available with the update KB5041876. Now, just a quick look at kind of the changes and improvements that are being gradually rolled out according to Microsoft. Uh, in this latest build for the beta channel and currently if we head in the stable version to our settings windows update and if we head to the advanced options and delivery optimization this is currently what the de delivery optimization page looks like in the stable version and microsoft says as the first change for this week's beta channel build that they've designed the settings page for delivery optimization to match the Windows 11 design principles. Now I'm not noticing too much difference between what they are showing us here and what is currently available but nonetheless that is listed as a change and an improvement. And then heading to the next one and Microsoft says there's now an option to turn off the suggestions to disable notifications from certain apps. So what you can do now in the beta channel is you can now press the little three dotted menu within the notification to disable the notification as you can with other notifications or you can go to the list of notification senders in your uh, setting system notifications and turn it off from there according to Microsoft. So that's a kind of a small under the hood tweak and adjustment. And then I think the big one with this update, Microsoft says they've updated the lock screen so that the media controls will now show at the lower bottom, at the lower bottom center of the lock screen, now when media is being played. With all these lock screen, these, sorry, these lock screen cards and widgets that Microsoft is popping now onto the lock screen, that space is now getting taken up because currently the media controls are yet to the right bottom right so now because of all these widgets and cards they're now popping that underneath um i don't really like it there but uh, nonetheless that's where microsoft seems to be headed so media controls will now show at the lower bottom center when media is being played according to microsoft and then there are a couple of fixes that are gradually being rolled out and these, there's actually three fixes, and I think all of them are important, so I'm just going to mention them quickly. They fixed an issue causing explorer.exe, which is the shell, the start menu, taskbar, file explorer, and so on, to crash for some insiders when closing apps from the taskbar in the latest flights. And they also fixed an issue causing the start menu to crash on launch in the last few flights for some insiders. So that's two crash important crash fixes that have rolled out and then they fixed an issue causing a memory leak after receiving certain notifications and a memory leak is a, a performance issue so that should increase the performance a little bit in the beta channel and then and because we are in effect still in preview in the beta channel there are two known issues which is common in the preview build so that's what's new more or less what's new uh, in beta build 22635.4082 for this week. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.